Once we get into about Wednesday, it is going to feel a little less like spring and a little more like summer. By the end of the week, this whole beach could be packed with people enjoying the sunshine, the smell of barbecue smoke wafting through the air, kids running around, and that's because Vancouver is about to get a stretch of hot weather. Yeah, actually, we are going to go to the beach 100%. What are you going to do this weekend? Um, uh, you're going to play t-ball? Yes. You want to go to the... <laughs> Break out the sunscreen, City News meteorologist Carl Lamb says the UV index will be high on Thursday with lots of sunshine and temperatures in the upper teens. When you have temperatures around 17 to 18 degrees by the water, it actually feels pretty nice. And then the weekend will be even warmer. We're talking about 20 to 25 degrees for daytime highs. So it really will start to feel like summer. Or maybe go for a run. Definitely play tennis, definitely go see all many, many walks like that. Are we going to like go hiking or something yeah, like that? Yeah, fine trail somewhere. Lamb says we're breaking loose from a drizzly cloudy April, but enjoy the balmy weather while it lasts. He says temperatures in the first week of May will be relatively cool. It doesn't look like it's going to hold. It looks like we're getting this big surge of warmth for a short window of time before we cool back down. Now, is it going to get really, really cold? Don't expect it to, but it is not going to be this type of summer preview across Metro Vancouver like we got last time. In Vancouver, Kirjunos, City News.